Well, I thought I would talk a little bit about the L Word, considering that this is the last season for it, and there's really only two episodes left. The reason that I am ahead, as to most Canadians, is because I watch it online. I like to be ahead. I just, I haven't watched this week's episode yet. So, I can't wait. But anyways, the reason I wanted to bring up the L Word was because I've had different conversations with people saying they don't like the L Word, or they do like the L Word. The reason they don't like the L Word is because they think that it doesn't betray lesbians in real life. Well, obviously, it is a TV show. Everything about a TV show is exaggerated. Um, has it gotten worse as the season's gone along? It's definitely gotten more far-fetched in some ways, yes. Um, is it time for the show to end? Sadly, it is. Um, the way that it's ending is it stupid. A little bit. I just hope that they, they wrap this whole thing up great and not have a bum ending like I've seen some shows. I used to love Sex and the City. I thought the show ended okay, but then they did the movie. Certain parts of the movie were funny, but I just thought the movie was kind of ruined the show. I don't know, and they're going to be making a sequel to the movie. It's just one of those things. One of those things you need to stop while you're ahead. And I remember uh, I used to watch Dawson's Creek, and they said that that was probably one of the worst endings to a show. I thought it was really good. I thought it was sad. And you know what? I liked the way that they wrapped everything up. Some of the things were a little far-fetched, but I liked the fact that Joy ended up with Dawson because... Or, sorry, Joy ended up with Pacey because you know what? You think that Joey and Dawson would end up together. But in reality, it's not always the underdog that loses. Sometimes he wins. But... I just wanted to say that, but yet a lot of lesbians love the L word. I'm probably going to have to say, anyways, out of people that I know, more people like it than not like it. So, if you're just as excited as watching the end of it with me, I'm going to talk about it when it ends. I've actually gotten some people into the L word that said to me before, this show looks like it's going to suck. What is this crap? etc 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 they actually ended up being one of the biggest fans I've ever seen in my life anyways it's now time to wrap up another week I will hope you all have a great week I will see you back here next Wednesday but before I go I'm actually taking an idea from Jeanette and Tony I'm thinking that Next week, I'm going to try to get my best friend to come on here because I would actually like to talk to her. Uh, we've been friends since we were practically out of diapers. And she's straight. And obviously, I'm gay. But I would actually like to get her opinion on what it was like to find out somebody she's known all her life coming out of the closet. I want to hear from her perspective and how that would be and how it was for her and how things are now. So, we'll see. Allison, I'm not telling you, by the way, her name's Allison. Allison, I'm not asking you. I'm just telling you. Be prepared to be on next Tuesday. <laughs> she's not camera shy. Oh, hopefully not. Until next week, guys. Bye. Say bye bye, Presley. Presley. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye, guys.